Welcome to Damien Passing the Family. I remember my dad doing this in 21 years ago, and my mom's been good to the grandchildren, so it was Cassie. She's quite a character. <laughs> well, I think Jamie and Kristen make a great couple. They look good together, and we knew something was up when Kristen said she's going to the hunting camp. <laughs> She said she was going to cook a meal, but we didn't know she didn't cook, so... <laughs> Anyways, thank you everybody for coming out. It's been a good day. Um, I'd just like to say thank you to Leanne for doing such a wonderful job. She's doing a great job. And thank you everybody for coming. Um, I'm so thankful for the wonderful weather. Um, I was actually having panic attacks about it, but it turned out really, really nice. And, um, you know, I was thinking through this whole thing. You, for years and years, I wondered, you know, why, why would God only grant me one daughter? And, well, because I could only afford one after this. <laughs> The other obvious is because she's the best, and I love you. And I'd also like to say that um, I think Jamie is a perfect match for Christian, and that They've really matched as a family. Um, with Patsy is their beautiful daughter. So congratulations, guys. Thank you very much, Aunt Karen. That was great. Christian Knox tonight. I'd like to welcome you to the family. We've had uh, Jamie's uncle come all the way from British Columbia today, and uh, a cousin all the way from uh, Regina, just for the event. She's the noisy one down front here. <laughs> and uh, I'd all also like to say uh, uh, a great uh, thank you for Greg and, and Karen for putting on, working hard, putting us all together. It's a beautiful event, and uh, she got a beautiful day, kept a good day for it, and uh, I think everybody's having a good time, right? <laughs> and uh, embarrassing moments for Jane. <laughs> <laughs> the only one I can think of offhand uh, is when he tried to burn down Pine River. <laughs> If anybody wants to ask him about that, I'm sure he'll give you the details. It involved field cars and, and wheat stomach. Fire trucks and neighbors and tractors and plows and everything. I'm sure he'll tell you all about it. And I wish, I hope, and I'd like to uh, also wish them uh, a great life together and many, many years of happiness. Hi everyone, it was a fantastic meal, it was a great wedding, everything was perfect, so I just wanted to say thanks to Karen Gray, and I've been thinking and thinking and thinking for days, how am I going to let Kristen know how happy she makes my son, and because I see it all the time, and as everybody knows, I take a lot of pictures, and if you know Jamie and you know his, you see pictures of him right from the time he was a little wee kid, He's either got the stern look on his face or the frown on his face or just a whatever. And I now have pictures of my son smiling. So, Preston, <laughs> you make him really happy. And in addition to Lynn's little story there, uh, <laughs> Mother's Instinct, you always know. The day that that little incident happened with Jamie, I was sitting in Ripley with uh, friends on their deck and the fire trucks went out and I said, that's my kid. And they're like, oh, Joe's like, you're just being ridiculous. It's not your kid. I'm like, no, I know that's my kid. So I phone, I phone the farm and I get Lisa and I'm like, Lisa, is everything okay? No, Jamie, that's a wheat field on fire. <laughs> <laughs> he 
kids would just know. <laughs> but anyway, Kristen, really glad to have you in the family. Love you, Jamie, love you very much. And Cassie, love you too, wherever you went to. <laughs> well, there you are. <laughs> and that's it. That's my mom's song. I wish I could have you as the best person in the world. It just wasn't so bad with you. It was just so perfect. My dad. I wish I could hang out with you. Just I wish it was so fun. It just isn't like this anymore. <laughs> Sometimes my mom can be... <laughs> 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 